this is for you a village girl this is for you Mwanyana people that grew up with less opportunities <laughs> hi guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is malisiba wagasekani but i am known as miss carol on my social media platforms if you are new to my channel welcome if you have been here before if you are a regular thank you so much please do not forget to share my videos with your friends your families your bosses your supervisors your foremen everyone that you know I would really, really appreciate that. So today we are shooting something very exciting. Finally, we are doing a kitchen tour. Yay! <laughs> a long awaited kitchen tour. Listen to me, get a long awaited. Like those YouTubers. Yes, a long awaited um, kitchen tour. So today we'll be shooting a kitchen tour i will be taking you around my kitchen in detail we'll be mentioning where everything is from if i remember hopefully i'll remember everything i do not want to miss a thing so yeah um i should have done it a long time ago i just delayed i don't know uh yeah but finally we are here we are doing it uh, I hope this doesn't come off as like a show off or anything like that. I am just doing this to motivate a young girl or Luena, it's possible. I didn't start here, Lena. I once stayed in a back room. I once stayed in a two bedroom apartment that didn't have nothing. So it's a process, you know, remover like that. So this is for you, a village girl. This is for you, Mwanyana Kulkishini. People that grew up with less opportunities, I just want you to look at this video with that eye. Or you know what? If she can, Lena, I can. So I am doing this for you so that you can be inspired. Luena Onaganor, one day, if she can have this beautiful kitchen, it's also possible for me. So that is that, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please do not forget to click the black the black subscribe button i would really 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 appreciate that uh someone told me commented on my video which one uh, i think it was the video where i went to valence or something like that yeah she said it's no longer a red subscribe button i can remember bahale rogopula youtube from way back in the day when it was still a red subscribe button but apparently it has changed. I saw it here. It has changed. It is a black subscribe button. Please check if you have subscribed. I would really, really appreciate that. If you haven't, if you normally watch my videos on, on TV, chances are that you may, uh, you might not be subscribed, right? That's the right English. <laughs> so if you normally watch my videos on TV, it could be that you're not even subscribed, but if you enjoy my channel, if you enjoy my content, the content that I, I produce, please click the right sub, I mean the black subscribe button. I would really, really appreciate that. Without wasting any more time, let us do this, guys. It's quite late in the day. I hope it'll be there. This kitchen actually doesn't have lighting. I think that is one of the, um, the things that i was set about when we first moved in actually when we moved into this house let me just give you a little bit of a background when we moved into this house uh it was a house that was already bought by someone so we did and then maybe along the way the process of purchasing a house that person decided to i don't know pull out or something hence i didn't get an opportunity to choose like a kitchen of my dreams but this kitchen is still not bad. I used to be sad about it. And my husband had to sit me down. I don't know. You're not going to be sad. Remember where you come from. You know, remember how you used to wish to have a kitchen with a, with a white countertop. So things like that. And I got to fall in love with it. I made sure that 
I decorate it according to how it would make me happy. So sometimes, and I had to also sit myself down, get the lecture or you know what, this is my first home. I don't, it doesn't necessarily have to look like those kitchens that I save from Pinterest and all of that. It's still a beautiful kitchen and I love it. And yeah, guys, let us get into the video. Let us do this. So as you enter through the main door, this is like the full overview of the kitchen. This is how it looks. And then as you face that way, you will see my four beautiful counter chairs that I got from Valence. They are actually wood with leather on top. And the disadvantage about this, guys, is that with wood, uh, it's all a makura like that. You see the oil and all of that. And sometimes even if you try to wipe them, uh, it's still there. So that is that. These are my four counter chairs from Vainland. I think some of you guys saw them. If you follow me on Instagram now and again, I would snap some items in my home. Love them so much. They are so, so beautiful. And then for my island, guys, look how big my island is. Bona, 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 bona. It is so big, guys. It is so big. It fits like four counter chairs. And I love the color, the fact that it's a bit white-ish, grayish. So I'm able to like snap cute photos of like my food and stuff like that. You know, content and stuff. And then this beautiful vase this beautiful vase or vase that i got from cory craft love it so much i really really love it and then those stems that i got from woolies via woolies dash that looks beautiful look at that as you come this side you see uh an open space i think this is where it was supposed to be a dryer but that space doesn't have a a plug or plumbing it doesn't have that so we decided to put our our heater base it just sits like that uh, i think maybe we might in the near future i might just decide to use this space as a vegetable maybe a building vegetable rack since i do not have and then as you come here you will find this little corner our coffee uh, like station type of a thing. Uh, I would imagine that if I had a coffee machine, this would be where it'll be sitting. But this is what you find. It's these canisters from Mr. Price Home. I got them from Mr. Price Home. As you come this side, it's this bowl, uh, a fruit bowl or a salad bowl. I use it as a fruit bowl from Country Road. I love the this backsplash actually that looks a little bit cloudy cloudy ish I love it so much while we are still this side you find this beautiful <laughs> beautiful washing machine just a washing machine that I got a long time ago from macro just a samsung washing machine i'm not gonna say mention price guys because some of them i forgot how much i bought them for that is my samsung washing machine love it so much and then as you come this side that is me over there <laughs> so that is my microwave yeah samsung uh, yeah this is how many liters is this I forgot but it's quite big i must say it's quite big so that is my microwave we have quite a number of cupboard space lots of cupboard space lots and lots of cupboard space i'm not gonna show you all of them as you come this side this is dedicated to olorado this is his his space this is where we put his stuff this is his this particular cupboard i'm also gonna show you this side where i have put all my mugs 
all my marks from the bottom up until top and then on this side we have our dustbin i'm not sure how many liters is this but it is quite big i have to say though we do not put like leftover food crumbs or anything like that just to avoid like the smells and stuff like that so we would put like your papers your this your this your that like but definitely not food we are avoiding cockroaches now let's move over to the side of our little pantry it's quite spacious i must say guys please don't kill me and <laughs> i haven't like arranged it or anything like that i need to buy like your storage containers to arrange this but it's just boxes and then kamo i have these are my verses guys look how many i have quite a number of verses because i receive flowers now and again buy myself flowers now and again and then kamo it's just our cleaning and uh just your household essentials and then mola it's our medicine box then as you come this side it's our drinks very empty i know but yeah that is what we have there and then that is that my trays that it's a storage guys it's a storage so that is how it looks from that side it looks like a a, a mini a mini spaza shop Shop I have my friend. <laughs> That's how disorganized it is. But this will be a project, guys. Everything is a project. Everything is a project. So I'll find time to reke the container and then arrange it when I have money. So yeah, that is our pantry. Coming this side is my favorite thing in this house. My fridge, guys. My fridge. This fridge love it so much i didn't want to compromise samsung as well you guys may have noticed that my appliances are samsung one thing about me when i buy appliances i make sure that they are the same brand like i get to be loyal to one brand like that so this fridge has this um options your water ice cubed and then crushed ice and you can also lock it here one other thing that i love about this fridge guys one feature that i really really love about this fridge it is this door this half door where i can just pull out a bottle of water or whatever that i need quickly i do not have to open the entire door like open the entire door like that i can just open like this when i need like your water or your juice or anything like that so that is my fridge guys i made sure that i don't compromise with this one i wanted like best of the best coming this side is just my two things quite big i must say please don't mind um what we have in one of the in one of the things it's just the shape that we're gonna be making later on in the day and it is stainless steel i love the silver i love i really really do love the silver this is our our kitchen window guys very small hence we don't have uh, a lot of lighting that's why i have decided to not close it for now i'll see as time goes on and then coming here is more cupboard space this is where we put like just the zipper things that we used to do our dishes this side is my beautiful beautiful dish washing machine guys look at that look at that this is beautiful guys love it so much i don't remember how much we got it for but i think it was like nine grand somewhere there yeah it was nine grand and um this is how it looks from here uh let me quickly just do that and then this is a button for like your options um different options you can see these classes and then pods just different options and then on this side as well so i love this dishwashing machine guys very beautiful 
coming this side is my toaster my smack toaster and blender they are just sitting there we use them quite often i must say that i'm actually starting to be skeptical with smack appliances for me actually i i wasn't lucky i wasn't lucky when it comes to them as you come this side you have more cupboard space more cupboard space and then camo it's our like breakfast stuff and then just our dry like cups your your spaghetti your macaroni and all of that your rice that is how i have packed it i think i didn't do bad with this one i actually didn't do too bad these containers i got them from at home and um what's that other Superbalist, this uh, Nepal. Nepal is a brand. I think they also have it go, go Yapi Chef as well. So these these containers, 80% of them are from at home and then maybe 20% if, is from uh, Nepal. Nepal is the brand that was previously sold go Superbalist. Now I see they have it at Woolies Home and then uh, Yapi Chef as well so i'm not gonna i'm not sure if i should come on the side more cupboard space more cupboard space come like our classes and all of that let me just quickly open this this is just our classes and then our little breakfast bowl and then as you go up there that is what you have this is our everyday classes that we use coming this side guys is my favorite part of the kitchen look at that look at that backsplash and then that over there so this is now my guest hop my guest stove love it so much guys to be having a um, a guest stove in this low sharing times that we live in initially the stove was actually a touch screen electric stove we had to change it late last year into a gas stove but our oven is still electric yeah our oven is still electric but the most important part is this one the defy slim line even the previous one was defy the touch screen electric one was defy love it so much guys i love this part of the kitchen it is so so beautiful and then that is the the extractor over there so beautiful and the thing with the gas stove guys something that you'd normally cook for like an hour you'd cook it for 30 minutes that's like the positive thing with a i guess stove coming this side guys is more cupboard space more cupboard space next just next to the stove and as you open this is what you find just your cooking oil vinegar and all of that and then going up is my plates balls nicely packed in those racks these racks i actually got them from pep home love them so much made my place to be a little bit organized my cabinets to be a little bit organized coming this side it's just the a spice cabinet that those are my spices that is how it looks that is how it looks i have arranged it like that these are all my spices guys all kinds of them love this right next to the stove easy to to get when you are cooking and stuff like that now for this open shelves guys this open shelves I actually didn't know how I should decorate them. Uh, I just put stuff on there. This is definitely not the final look. But what I have there is just like your recipe books. I have the one year lona and then the one year the lazy maguti as well. This one year lona, guys, if you want. Now I am a master of oxtail because of this book. You won't regret. And then up there, I have like my Le Creuset pot. The crusted pot with my two salt and pepper shakers from country road up there is just like a vase with like your little uh yeah just your vase that vase i got it from country road 
and then that little cake stand is from H&M Home, the two cups from Mr. Price Home, that little chopping board at the back, it was a gift that my friend got me, that is from Poetry Home. So yeah, that is how this shelf looks, guys. And that is how it looks currently. And then this little, little bowl, we just put it here just to put like your keys and stuff like that. It's just sitting here for us to put like your keys. shelves really really love them so much for my pots both of them i have put my pots on the second shelf i have my other pots those are um, russell hop these i got a long time ago i think in 2020 and then here is my le Creuset pen set love it so much best of the best love it love it love it so that is how this two shelf looks the second shelf is just your russell hop pots and then my beautiful uh, le Creuset pens yo this i love these guys love them love love them we have quite a lot of cupboard space i must say and then we have this four shelves for like your utensils and stuff like that the first one is just like my spoons like your forks and all of that teaspoons knives these these guys i got them from mr price home look look but anyway it's fine so and then on the second shelf this is what we have like your saving um spoons and all of that third shelf i have my cooking spoons maho and all of that um and then i have this beautiful beautiful spoon rest from country road love this so much the material i think it's porcelain love it love it love it uh on the last one <laughs> the last one is a bit of a mess it's just a bit of everything a bit of everything just miscellaneous stuff in there with regards to my kitchen tour i hope you enjoyed it please do not forget to share my channel with your friends your family people that you know i would really really appreciate that i just want to apologize for uh, items that i didn't mention where they are from and stuff like that another thing my kitchen doesn't have that much lighting Hopefully this video will be clear and all the items will be as clear as possible because we really, really tried. I was shooting with Makari. We really, really tried with the ring light and all of that uh, where we could, but there is nothing I can do. Like I mentioned, that's why I didn't put a blind on my kitchen um, window for now because like there's no light in this kitchen. That is one of the things that uh is really a bummer about this kitchen but other than that i really really love my kitchen guys it's spacious uh the fact that it can fit four big counter chairs actually five it's just that we have decided to put four but i really really love my kitchen i love all my appliances all of them i really really do love them so yeah Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video, which will then be a vlog. I'm not sure when this particular video will go up. Um, I'm really not sure, but we'll see as time goes on. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. If you have watched up until this far, 
thank you so much for watching before i go guys i'm sure you have noticed that we have ads on my videos kindly please watch the ads i would really really appreciate that this was fun i really really enjoyed it i hope you enjoy it on your side as well i will see you guys in my next video thank you so much for watching